today I am going to make goat hot pot. The ingredient need for the hot pot gonna be vegetarian seasoning, some mushroom, black fungus, herbal mix, it's like this, canor seasoning, coconut water. Some of the five spice powder, saute, oil, black pepper, fermented bean curd, taro. This is the uh, black fungus that I um, soak in the water for overnight. This is how it looks like. Lotus root, yellow noodle, Napa cabbage, mustard green, garlic, ginger, lemongrass, shallot, red pepper, and of course, goat ribs. After my water boil, I put my goat in it. And add some ginger some salt and about half of a cup of cooking wine. I'll stir it up a little bit and then I put my lid back. In the zip bag, I put my ginger and my lemongrass inside the bag. And then I'll smash it. I'll put my shallot. I'll put it in the, the zip bag that I had earlier. The shallot in it. And the garlic. Tablespoon of canola seasoning, tablespoon of the vegetable seasoning, about a teaspoon of the black pepper, and a teaspoon five spice powder. In 
the medium pot, I put my goat. You pour like a, a tablespoon of oil. And then we just stir it. And then on a different pot, you fill up halfway with water to cook your yellow noodle. So turn it on high. And put the lid on the top. Just kind of, you have to kind of spread it out. Because if you don't, if you put the whole roll in like this, it doesn't come out good. You stick together and it won't taste good. So you kind of loosen it up. Wait until the water boil and put it in. So this, is good. this is ready to put the water in. Oops. Okay, just pour the water in. About a liter and a half of water. Stir it up and then put the lid over the top. This is a bag in size. So it's another bag, small bag. Just drop that in there. And then this pack this bag, the cotton bag. Cut a bowl in there and then tie it up drop it in there with a little berry bag this is called berry I don't know I think it's called berry I just put them in So add my lotus root in the pot. And then put the lid back on. After the water boil. my yellow noodle in and then just stir it up for about 10 seconds and then I pour it out and you keep doing this until it's cool down Cool down a little bit. I'll put it in an aluminum tray. What I like to do is to put a, a tablespoon of oil. And some fries shallot. The mustard green and Napa cabbage. I 
after two hours. I'll take out the opal bag. The other opal bag. Rock sugar, about this much. Mushroom. Add my taro. And the coconut water. Teaspoon of salt. And turn my heat on high. Stir it up. On. There's boil. Just kind of stir it up. Now you can taste your soup and see if it's need to add more salt or seasoning. Just add like a half of a tablespoon of the canor seasoning. Turn your heat on low for about 10 minutes. For the dipping sauce, I have some pepper and garlic, a, a teaspoon of sugar. The fermented bean curd. I take three pieces. Three pieces. And then you just smash it. Add a little bit of satay. And then the lemon. And just mix it up. stove and then turn it on when you eat hot pot you need a portable stove and then while waiting for it to be boiled again you take a you take a 
a small bowl. Take some of the noodle. You put it in a bowl. And you take some of the mustard green. Napa cabbage. Blow down the heat a little bit. Veggie done. We'll put the veggie in the pot in the bowl. And then scoop the soup in your bowl. And you, you could use the dip. And then that's it, ready to serve.